Welcome to our weekly Bible Reader Companion Series. This week our reading is taken from Galatians chapters 5 and 6, Ephesians uh, chapters 1 through 6, and Philippians chapters 1 and 2, with our memory verse being taken from Galatians 6 and verse 2. From the New King James, our memory verse reads, Bear one another's burdens, and so fulfill the law of Christ. How we react when a fellow Christian is overtaken in sin can help restore their soul or hinder, hinder their repentant return to the Lord. The spiritual Christian is mature in the faith and responds uh, in meekness with empathetic urgency, the spirit of gentleness that we read about. Without delay and careful to avoid using self-righteous words and actions, mature Christians recognize their own exposure to sin's temptations and come in the spirit of gentleness. Ready to bear the burden for the soul captured by sin, but we should humbly accept the task by using the direct and loving correction of reproof, rebuke, and exhortation from God's word. Surely this is how we would want others to approach us if we had fallen into sin, as we consider uh, what Jesus writes over in Matthew chapter 7 and verse 12. Hopefully, this describes how we would treat someone overtaken in a trespass. If it doesn't, we need to consider ourselves, make the needed corrections, and then look forward to helping our brethren uh, as they work their, if they sin and as they work their way out of sin. This willingness and ability of a mature Christian to bear the burden of a fellow disciple overtaken by sin and attempting to restore him requires uh, humility, examining oneself, and accepting one's spiritual responsibility. This is what it means to bear his own load in verse 5. Here is the essential meaning of the application of verses 3 through 5, that you, as you think about what we read. Without this preparation of faith and character, we are ill-equipped to fulfill the law of Christ when others need help overcoming sin. As a mature Christian, we understand that we are not the savior of the fallen, the Lord is. We are just merely a servant of the Lord doing his work. The mature, the mature Christian's joy in doing this work does not come from measuring uh, ourselves against the failures or success of others. Mature Christians rejoice in, in doing our duty. This is our own work uh, that we need to think about in verse 4, and giving Christ the glory and honor, because as unprofitable servants, we have just done what was our duty to do. Our responsibility is to fulfill the law of Christ and to love one another by helping restore the fallen. Remember, the law of liberty uh, frees us from sin, but not from the restraints in following the law of Christ. Pride and self-promotion can prevent us from fulfilling this task and our work of God. Let's examine ourselves to make sure that we're not full of pride uh, or self-conceit uh, to make sure that we are doing what we should be doing, fulfilling the law of Christ. Let's continue to meditate on God's word together. Galatians 6 and 2 is our memory verse. Bear one another's burdens and so fulfill the law of Christ. Thank you and join us again tomorrow as we continue to meditate on God's word together. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook for more content like this.